And a draft law authorizing same-sex marriage passes first committee review in the legislators today. The law now goes for cross-party consultations, which will be a stiffer test as lawmakers are split over the law. Public protests outside the legislature also highlighted the views of supporters and opponents. The Judiciary and Organic Law and Statutes Committee convener Yo Mei Nu today announced that the draft amendments to the Civil Code in the form of an extra paragraph permitting gay marriage had passed a preliminary committee review and had moved on to the stage of cross-party consultations. Allowing gay marriage won't ruin homes or destroy the concept of marriage. All the legal bindings of ordinary heterosexual marriage should apply equally to all homosexual marriages. The Draft Marriage Equality Act crucially amends Article 972 of the Civil Code relating to marriage by adding a paragraph saying that homosexual marriages shall be made by the two parties involved. But many lawmakers express conflicting opinions. On my identity card, the wording for giving my mother and father's names will be replaced with parent one and parent two. I'm sorry, but I can't accept this. Even if the civil code is ultimately amended, regardless of the version you adopt, will everyone's identity card have to change? Will the current wording of father and mother need to change to just parents? We all know it won't. Outside the legislature, there were two groups of protesters. Groups supporting gay marriage happily waved the rainbow flag that symbolises the LGBT minority group. Opponents of gay marriage, however, marched from the legislative UN to the presidential office as they strongly expressed their dissatisfaction.